How's it going? Today I am out in Norfolk, Virginia in the Neon District and I'm gonna go around and take some photos. So all I'm gonna use to edit my photos is this mobile card reader. And this is what I wanted to show you today because this thing is super helpful when it comes to just getting your photos straight off your camera and to your phone. I know there's been so many times where I went out shooting and somebody's like, oh, let me see that photo. And I'm like, well shit, you can see on this tiny little screen or they want me to send them the photo or you know, I wanted to edit the photo right away so I can post it. But no, I have to go home, get on my computer, open up Lightroom, whatever app I'm using, and then edit the photo, send it to my phone. It's a long process. So with this guy here, you can just bring along your phone. And I use Snapseed to edit my photos. So uh, basically, you just use this. You transfer over the photos from the day, and you're good to edit off your phone. So I'm gonna go out now and shoot some photos in Norfolk, Virginia. I just moved here, a uh, video coming on that soon. But uh, yeah, let's go take some photos. I thought today was a good example of using the mobile card reader because I went out to the beach at sunset, super pretty sunset, take a look. And it's just like a really nice night and it's one where I don't really want to go home at the moment, go to my computer, go to Lightroom, get my photo all edited, then send it to my phone and then post on Instagram or you know share with a friend, whatever. So uh, I brought the mobile card reader with me and my phone. So it's pretty simple, I'll just go through it like while I'm here. And I think it's really nice because it's like, you know, you're just enjoying the beach and you know, sun is set, but I still kind of want to enjoy like the nice weather going on and I don't really just want to like go home yet. So I think it's a cool way to, you know, share a little bit of the moment with somebody else uh, and it's super easy. So I just threw in the memory card I was shooting with there um, onto the card reader, just grab your phone out. Try to not have sand in your phone port. And then you just go in on your phone here. It'll say import. I'll show a closer version of this so you don't have to worry. But you just go to import. For mine, I have a lot on this card, so I scroll all the way down to the bottom. And then you'll see the most recent stuff. It takes a little bit to load because it's reading the card. Um, and there's the beach stuff there. So I'll just import it to my phone. And then yeah, I have the beach photos I can go through and I can basically choose whichever ones I wanna use. So I mean, it's super small, easy to take with you. It's, it's just honestly what I do when I'm out taking photos. I like to have it on me because if I'm honest in my photo editing process, I really don't use Lightroom all that much. I know I should learn it more and actually use it way more because it is really helpful with a lot of great tools. Uh, but for me, for example, I use Snapseed a lot, which is just on my phone. And it makes it really easy to just always be able to just take my camera phone and this little guy and I'm good to go. So uh, I definitely would recommend it. If you do want to pick one up, um, I have it linked in the description below. So that's about it to the card reader. Super simple, but I did want to share it because I've been asked about it at least once or twice. Um, and it's definitely like one of the top camera accessories I would recommend uh, obviously because everybody has a phone now so it's it's nice to pair them together but that's about it when it comes to the card reader it's getting a little dark so I'll let you guys go I hope you are doing well and I hope this video did help you out if it did make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more filmmaking and photography content and I'll see you guys next week